If you have a Hummingbird Onyx, there's a new software upgrade that you need to know about. It's version 2.3, and it brings enhancements to existing Onyx features and also imports altogether new functions, making your Onyx unit faster and even more powerful than ever before. There are too many new features to talk about each one individually, so let's cover just a few of the highlights. The new software allows you to network your Onyx unit to select core Ethernet capable Hummingbird units like your 800, 900, or 1100 series units. And that allows you to share waypoints across the network between your Onyx and select Hummingbird units. On your chart screen in areas where you have dense waypoints, you'll also have the waypoint clustering function. It groups waypoints together when you're zoomed out, but allows you to see each individual waypoint when you zoom in for a closer look. There's a Bluetooth remote now that will sync with your Onyx unit and allows you to do key features from anywhere in your boat, like marking waypoints. Chart screen functions are enhanced also by the encoder wheel. Now as you spin the encoder wheel, you can zoom in and out faster than ever before. You can also import waypoints from other sonar manufacturers, making the switch to the Hummingbird Onyx even easier. Now, let's go look at these features in a little bit more detail, but let's do it on the water. I'm here today with Field Marketing Manager Bill Carson, and we're testing out the Hummingbird 2.3 software. It's got a ton of new features. We just looked at one, the waypoint clustering, and then we got interruption. It's a good thing. There's a lot to show you, so we're going to put some hands-on units and show you exactly what the new features do. Hold on, this is going to be really cool. Jeff, I want to show you how waypoint clustering looks on the screen, and I want to show you why there's a benefit to waypoint clustering. If you look at the screen here, you see these little balloons, and each balloon has a number on it. So there's 15, there's 3, there's 2, there's 39 right there. Yeah, that's, that's a hot spot. <laughs> well, it's telling me that there's 39 waypoints that are in that general vicinity right there or within a certain distance, and that distance changes based on the zoom level. But the bottom line is, is that the machine doesn't have to keep up with every one of those 39 waypoints, so I can see that they're all there. As I zoom in on it, now I can see the individual waypoints because they're targets I want to go fish at, and it frees up my unit to do other things. Man, this is, this is crazy. The new Bluetooth, I literally have the ability to mark right here. I'm standing back here at the back of the boat working. Look at that, new waypoint. It is awesome. And you know, Jeff, there are a lot of other things that this remote has the ability to do. I mean, I can literally change views. I don't have to work around you if you're standing in the cockpit of the boat or at the helm. I don't have to work around you at all. I just need to be able to peep around you and see what's going on there. And I can press the buttons and I can preset the buttons for a lot of different things. So it gives you a lot of flexibility in how you use your unit and what you want to see Bottom using line this. Is when you're on board, you can fish all the way around the boat and still have instant command of your unit, mark waypoints, and do everything you need. Absolutely. One of the other cool features in 2.300 is the ability to zoom in and zoom out using the encoder wheel. That's the little wheel that's around the joystick. Let me show you how quick this thing is. So when I want to zoom in, I can zoom in. When I'm ready to zoom out and look at a broader area, I can zoom out just that quick. I want to zoom back in. It's really quick in its ability to zoom in and zoom out. All right, so how do I know that 2.30 is actually linking the waypoints on both units? It's really simple, Jeff. Any dots that are blue reside on the core product. Any dots that are green reside on the Onyx. And I can tell which dots are on which one. Nice. Jeff, this is, this is a nice fish. That is. You know, we looked at a handful of things on the sonar. There was a number of upgrades on software 2.3, the free upload, but it all comes down to success and you're holding success in two hands. No doubt about it. This guy right here is a beautiful fish and uh, I'm glad he came to say hello.